Couple final areas with respect to the outsource purchase order functionality is number one, if you are on one of the advanced tier packages, outsource purchase orders works also with multi-currency. So anytime that you're buying those manufacturing services from another supplier who provides their services in a different currency, we support the ability to issue an outsource purchase order with a different currency from your base currency. This makes it possible as well that whenever those items are received, it will convert it to the correct cost that your base currency is uh, using in your Katana account. It's also integratable with your uh, accounting integrations, uh, the ones that we currently have, including Zero and QuickBooks. Another area that uh, is interesting, which is something that we're currently working on and we don't yet have at the time of making these videos, is the ability to support full traceability batch tracking from the material level all the way to the product level. To date, you can issue batch numbers for any batch trackable products that are received on an outsourced purchase order, but it's not possible yet to identify what specific batches are used in the um, ingredients element for the uh, products that are manufactured. This is something that will be released in the next few months, uh, but our team is working on it and it will be made available. The outsourced purchase order functionality is available on all plans. So whether you're on the essential package and beyond, you can use this feature. Just with multi-currency changes as we get into the higher tiered subscription packages. Now, the last area that would be of interest for anybody is um, on the outsource purchase order list. In the done tab, um, also the open tab is available. You can actually uh, download your outsource purchase orders as CSVs or Excel spreadsheets. Um, I'll download one real quick as an XLS. And when you download it, you can see some breakdowns on some information that might be important for you um, whenever it comes to tracking, let's say, your costs. So here you can see all of the order numbers um, and what items are inside of them, including the quantity ordered and the price of the manufacturing services per unit. So remember, an outsource purchase order creates the price of that manufacturing service per unit, um, including tax rates, receive dates, uh, the order currency as well as the conversion for the order currency and then you can see here uh, what is the total ingredients cost for those items so uh, and this is a roll-up of all of the materials that made that specific product and then a product total cost per unit so this is basically the number of products ordered divided by the total cost will give you uh, this particular number and then you can see the product total cost here in general, which um, will give you everything that you need to see. Uh, and that's, yeah, pretty much a general overview of the outsourced purchase order. So um, if you need to solve those very specific problems for your contract manufacturing, I uh, hope you found that this videos, these videos were helpful and, uh, and uh, hope you will get the best out of this feature.